right, I'm back, and uh, it's only been a week since my last video. Haven't really done a whole lot more on the actual boat hull. I went ahead and pulled some mast staves out of the storage in my man cave, and I glued up the scarf joints halfway down and I've got the four foot sections down below so when everything's all put together here's a four foot section um, it'll be 16 uh, 20 foot 20 foot mast uh, all these get put together in a bird mouth configure it's got a bird mouth cut on it and so eight pieces will make uh, octagon shape which then you uh, plane off all the edges and make it nice and round and I'll also have to taper the uh, the top and I'll work on that before it's all glued together. In the garage I found myself my beams in the attic that go across the garage. I've got a, a beefy beam right up in the middle and then in the back I went ahead and actually rested a uh, two two by fours across some floor joists up there or ceiling joists and then ran the straps through from there I've just got some uh, rope and under that I've got some ratchet straps so what I'll end up doing is uh, I'll have some help pick up like the bow end first tighten up the ratchet strap you know, pull out all the slack and then ratchet it up to where I need it to be able to get the cradle out from underneath um, and it should work also when it comes to flipping the hole over I'm hoping so we'll see how all that goes uh, inside the boat really haven't done much um, like I said I was working on the uh, mast and uh, I did glue my transom in place yesterday and I don't think I've got it or put it back in at the at just the correct angle because now I'm back to having a little bit of a gap down here so I, I marked what I need to take off near the top of each motor well piece and then uh, I'll refit it I was gonna try to glue in or, or glue all this together this bulkhead the motor well sides and the aft transom glue all three or all these pieces together and then glue it all into the boat and then I wouldn't have to keep reworking these pieces but um, I really do need to uh, they, they suggest fiberglassing the two bottom garboards garboards whatever they're called you know technical nautical technical terms two bottom hole pieces um, the center area I did not put any glue down because that'll get cut out for the centerboard case and down here somewhere in the middle is also where it's uh, a water ballast so that's why they recommend putting fiberglass in on the bottom down below. So that's where I'm at. I did buy a trailer yesterday. Went up to Waterloo, South Carolina, about an hour and a half north of here. And bought a nice trailer that normally had a, oh, what was it? Like a ski boat on it. 18-foot uh, ski boat. So I might have to modify the bolt. Um, bunks a little bit but everything um, it should fit this uh, sailboat real nice so that's about it and uh, let me throw this uh, video together thanks for watching